Hi guys, welcome to another short video of SpaceX updates. In this video, I am gonna talk about the latest updates from Starbase and the status of SpaceX's Falcon Heavy launch. Yesterday, SpaceX conducted a cryo test on the full stack Booster 7 and Ship 24. On Monday, the LOX tank of Booster 7 was tested. And yesterday, methane tank of the booster was tested by filling it with cryogenic liquid nitrogen. Basically, both the tanks might be tested for any leak checks before a wet dress rehearsal which could happen any day now. We still have possible road closure schedules throughout the whole week. So completing a successful wet dress rehearsal on the fully stacked Starship for the first time is a big possibility this week. In preparation for the upcoming mega static fire of 33 Raptor 2 engines for Booster 7, in this shot from Starship Gazer, we can see SpaceX welding up a lot of shieldings around the OLM legs to protect critical parts and plumbing. Falcon Heavy's launch is getting closer and more real. After three years, on Monday, next week, SpaceX will launch its long-awaited United States Space Force's Falcon Heavy mission, USS F-44 mission. A few hours ago, SpaceX's most powerful rocket went vertical on Pad 39A for a static fire test later today. And after that, it will head inside the hangar again to integrate the classified payloads and fairings in the second stage. And it will be rolled out to the pad for final launch countdown. Later today, SpaceX will launch another Starlink mission. Falcon 9 with 53 more Starlink satellites on top will lift off from Vandenberg Space Force Base in California. This mission will be number 49 for SpaceX this year only. The first stage booster supporting this mission will be on its eighth flight today. So, today will be an exciting day for SpaceX and its fans including you and me. Hope you all have a great day, and I will see you soon in the next video.